So <laughs> earlier, I was in the bathroom and mm -hmm. Dave came up to me, flustered, like, man, I gotta tell you, okay, I think Josephine is cheating on me. And I'm like, I just don't zip my pants, guy. I'm, I'm, <laughs> well, I, I guess it, it kind of makes sense why she's not around anymore. I mean, she was way out of his league anyways. She was, but I mean, he's a sweet guy, you know? He was very caring, he was very giving. He was very needy. Very needy. Speaking of loneliness, um, I actually have something I need to talk to you about. What's that? Um, so I went into Joe's office yesterday and I actually gave him my two weeks. <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry, I, I, I got a job and I've been really debating taking it and I wanted to tell you, but I knew you would just sway me to stay and I really need the of money. Of course I would sway you to stay. Like, what the hell am I supposed to do now? Like, uh, what am I supposed to do when Joe makes some racist remark? Who am I supposed to look at? Who am I supposed to make eyes? You can eyes? text me, dude. I, I, my job is still data entry. I will still have a lot of time to goof off. What about when Jessica is always sitting there fucking grinding her teeth and tapping on her fucking mouse pad and, uh, like, I'm gonna go crazy. And what about when Tim, like, always comes up and grabs me by the shoulder and is like, hey, brother. And, like, you know how much I fucking hate that? <laughs> it's and, so like, weird. you're the only person I can vent to about that shit, man. I mean, there, I, I know most of the people we work with are absolutely horrible, but what about Kenny, okay? I know, I know he's, you know, fresh out of college, but I think he has a lot of potential as a work best friend. He really likes music. You know, he plays Bro, guitar. I don't know what the hell he's listening to. It's that wah, 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 and he fucking... It's new age, I don't even okay. understand what he's talking about half the time. Uh, nor do he's I. He's always on his phone. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going to feel like the old guy trying to be young. That's not me. I think you should finally chase... Chase your music dream. Like, I I think you're an amazing singer, and I, I, the voice is having auditions soon. Just go do it. What's to lose? Like, the worst that happens is you meet Kelly Clarkson. Or I don't, and I go to one audition, and then my dreams are completely shattered, and then I'm even sadder, and the next thing you know, I'm drinking every week, and then I Okay, you're lose spinning job, out. You're spinning then, out a little bit. Let's say I make it on one episode of The Voice, okay? Yeah. Yeah, and then I get voted off, okay? And then, like, some woman who, like, thought I was cool, like, um, is attracted to me, and then she, like, starts stalking me, and, like, she follows my Instagram, and then, like, she, like, falls in love with me, and I don't know that she's been stalking me this whole time, and then she, okay, like, murders Leonard, me in my sleep, Leonard, okay? stop, okay? First of all, having a stalker would be kind of cool, and I think you could handle it. You know what? I mean, maybe I should try out for the voice. Yes, what? You have nothing to lose. Nothing to lose. And, you know, everybody loves when I get on stage for karaoke. I try Running not to get too house. big of a head about it, yeah. you know? You have to do Jack and Diane as your audition song for the voice. Oh my God. Right? Yes. I don't sing that very often, but I when I do sing that, it, it hits me. Sometimes it's good. I want to, like, cry on stage myself. I wonder where my youth has gone.